I'm about to return these forks to their owner. Uh, they are my father's forks. He and I both bought uh, 2005 John Deere products. I bought a 790. He bought a 990. He bought a set of these slip-on forks. And he's a retired toolmaker machinist. And uh, in outfitting his home shop, uh, he used these forks to set a good-sized meal. And... Uh, and a lathe in his shop, so they're they're very strong forks. Uh, and in the the building of my cabin, uh, these proved to be very useful uh, in moving logs, in lifting logs. Uh, the forks are stronger than my tractor, and that meaning that uh, the forks will hold more force than my tractor will exert. Uh, they're very strong, very well built. Uh, pause just for a moment. I'm going to set a calipers back on. Uh, we're rolling. I got my calipers. Uh, these forks are built from five millimeter steel, exactly five millimeters. I gauge with my calipers. Like I said, they're very strong. Uh, I don't remember the supplier, uh, but they clamp onto the bucket. Underneath here, there are a couple of spacers. And then you've got a, a big round piece here and then a big heavy clamp. Now the only downside to this type of fork is that if you bump something, get some side force there, the fork will move. It's not rigid. The only way you can improve that is to put something, a spacer in there that clamps through the forks. Now, uh, having said all that, moving lumber, moving logs, uh, a workstation, level this off. You level these forks off and you've got a workstation. You see this box here on the end of the forks. I fabricated that for uh, putting shingles up on the roof. Uh, and the box uh, encapsulates the ends of the forks. Uh, this holds uh, two bundles of shingles and you extend those all the way up and it easily reach the top of the garage here and higher so that's something to think about very useful tool uh, you can tell i've done a, a good bit of work with these forks for the, for the finish off of we'll remove one look at the bottom side of it Very heavy built box section. Um, I don't know what the mill and lathe weigh, but uh, they're they're both very large. And uh, everything I've done with the forks, I've had no issue with them whatsoever. Very durable. Uh, so thank you, Mr. Ronnie Lewis, for the loan of these forks. And for the rest of you, thank you for watching. And uh, Whatsoever your hands find to do, do it with all your might.